This has been one of the toughest challenges I've ever set. There were times that I honestly didn't think both restaurants were going to make it. And I started to panic. And as the clock ticked away, the restaurants just started emerging, becoming individual restaurants with identity, character. And the atmosphere in both restaurants, amazing. The food, stunning. And on the back of the last three hours, you've made it incredibly difficult for me to decide on which restaurant's going through to the final. That's what a pop-up restaurant is all about. A one-off, one night only, unique experience. And on the back of that performance, it's such a close call. Based on everything I've seen. These guys definitely understand flavors. Let's see how the cucumber goes with all of this. Yeah, weird. Four croquetas. Everything I tasted. That's delicious. Lovely. It's a proper Spanish dish. Yeah. That's picturesque. Beautifully presented plate of food. Everything I've listened to. Casimir restaurant, check on table wow. four. Nice one, Mum. To make her happy, she wants the potatoes. Can we do it? Yes. If we can do them, chef, please. The restaurant going through to the final. Is Casimir. Yes, 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 son. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Well done. You can smile. You can smile. You'll get you. Thank you. Well done. Well done. For us, it was a new, you know, new challenge. So it was really tough. Obviously disappointed, but I mean, the guys, they are amazing. Casimir are in the final because they understood for the first time in this competition what customers want. John Ray and Peter dropped the frills and they delivered. I think they're amazing. It's, it's, it's incredible. We've got two little geniuses, but my God, can they cook. Fucking impressive.